As a reliever, I had a 1.98 earned run average. I won one game and I lost three games, saved 12 games. Although I sometimes felt tightness in my pitching elbow, I uh, pitched the entire season without meaningful discomfort. However, after the season, I noticed that I could not bend my pitching arm up to my shoulder and I could not extend it out straight. I immediately went to my doctor for x-rays. First, let's see why I could not fully extend my pitching elbow. How deeply the tip of the olecranon process goes into its fossa determines the extension range of motion. Compared with my glove elbow, the olecranon process of my pitching arm does not go into its fossa as far. Careful measurements of my glove and pitching elbows showed that baseball pitching caused me to lose 12 degrees of my extension range of motion in my pitching elbow. Now, let's see why I could not fully flex my pitching elbow. The length of the coronoid process determines the flexion range of motion of the elbow. Compared with my glove elbow, the coronoid process in my pitching elbow has lengthened considerably. Careful measurements of my glove and pitching elbows showed that baseball pitching also caused me to lose 12 degrees of my flexion range of motion in my pitching elbow. Nobody told me that baseball pitching could permanently deform my pitching arm. I was and remain mad as hell.